Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Ninja Gardening. Today I want to show you a vine that's native here to the west. And even though it's native, it's kind of a, an, a pest to agricultural and residential areas. And this is false Virginia creeper. So it has five leaves on it. And this is often used as an ornamental. And it looks almost exactly like Virginia creeper. The only difference is, is the way that it climbs. So if your vine has tendrils on it, it's the false Virginia creeper. And if it has little pads on it that help it climb up trees or telephone poles, it's going to be true Virginia creeper. So the plants are both related. They both have these five leaves arranged in the same way. And they have the berries. The berries will turn kind of a bluish purple later when they get ripe. And the birds really like these. It's the primary vector for them. But they are commonly used as ornamental vines because they are quite vigorous and they are used to cover up unsightly structures. So here you can see we have a chain link fence and this vine has grown all over it. Now the problem comes is with these berries. The berries are a source of food for many species of birds and they will uh, they'll eat those and then they as birds do they'll land on a fence or a power pole or in a in a tree or a shrub and then those uh, berries are dispersed with a little bit of fertilizer and then you'll get a vine growing before you know it. Now it's not all bad because as I said it was used as an ornamental and in the fall, it turns a very brilliant, pretty shade of orangish red, and it's very striking to look at. And so, you know, you, you won't notice it because it blends in with the green. And then uh, as soon as it turns fall, it's uh, very impressive to look at. So now Virginia creeper does the same thing too, so which is often why Virginia creeper is planted. So, but, uh, so I got a guy walking here with his dog, but uh, it's uh, it's somewhat of an agricultural nuisance. So uh, the other thing that's problematic is some people are allergic to it, and it will have a they'll have a reaction to it similar to poison ivy. Obviously, I'm not so because I'm touching it, but. Anyway, I mean, now we got a bunch of dogs barking. Um, I'm going to go ahead and end this video. So this is False Virginia Creeper. And if you found this video informative, please like and subscribe.